All right, here, but each jump, but Jack, and Tate Bosco. And we're here today to talk about a very interesting challenge I had this morning. My audio was not working with Google Hangouts in Google Chrome, and it was driving me crazy trying to figure it out. And um, I don't know, maybe others of you have experienced this little challenge. So I was telling Ted about it, and Ted had no idea what I was talking about, as usual. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, so anyway, so I, we, we decided, well, one, I created a little video that you can see. I walked through the steps, but we also said, well, why don't we make a little hangout on it, and we will uh, walk through the steps here as well. So we did, and uh, had made us some great little snag -it shots. And I don't know, anything you want to say about it before we get rolling with it? Or? Um, no, I mean, so we, it was just... Um, some odd things as soon as John mentioned I started looking at the hangout and we noticed there was an extra little item there which uh, we will what I'll do I'll share the screen and John can walk you through it yeah and I was gonna say too some of you may have noticed about a week was it a week ago or not quite a week ago where they made some changes to Chrome and they added this in and then it asked you in Google Plus as you're doing your first Hangout, whether you wanted to uh, approve the use of your video and your audio. I think it was Camera. maybe... Yeah. I think it was maybe... Camera little, the, yeah, week to two weeks. Yeah, week to two weeks. I asked you if you could um, you approve the use of your camera and microphone. So, yeah, let's show the, uh, let's show the slides here. So, if you look in your URL window at the top, you'll see this little camera that Ted's pointing to here. And it's up at the very, very, up at the very, very top. You know, obviously your URL is there, and it's got the camera. It's got a little magnifying glass, and then the star where you can bookmark your site. And that little camera, when you click on it, the next thing you see is you see your uh, setup, what what microphone you have, and what camera you have. And you'll notice here that under microphone may or may not show your correct microphone. I believe it will not show your correct microphone. It's just going to show as default. And it is going to show, because usually we have multiple microphones, some of us, from different things. And camera is going to show as the actual camera uh, correctly, in my estimation. So next slide there, Ted. Drop press that one, though. <laughs> just underneath that box, you'll see Manage media settings. Right. So that's where we're going next. Manage media settings. So when we go to manage media settings, you can see where it says for Google Plus is who we're really talking about with Hangouts. It uh, wants you to allow your audio and allow your video to set in. All right. So here we are. And you can see in media. Um, well, all right, Ted's is showing his microphone as default. In there, for me, mine would show um, my blue snowball instead of default. So right where Ted's circling around the microphone, mine actually shows blue snowball on Logitech HD. So if you've got a separate microphone that you use, like a podcasting microphone or a headset, um, it may sh that's going to show as your correct microphone. Ted uses his Logitech, so it's showing as default. All right. And where that is, it's in your... Um, Chrome settings. Yeah, Chrome settings. So here we are again. So if you look now up top in our settings in Hangouts, you're going to see it shows as Logitech webcam default instead of your actual microphone that you're using because Google has asked you to use it as the audio device, and so it's saying it's your default, and then it's also showing your speakers as default. That is a little different change. If you were to go in there, like I did this morning, crazy me, I went and I actually set it normally as my blue snowball and the camera correctly and all that. I had no audio, which uh, was not making me a very happy camper. So you may find that you end up in a similar situation and are trying to figure out how to get through that. And um, that, my friends, is the answer. The other thing that I had to do is I had to go to uh, my Chrome settings and go back to 
the factory restore. I had to restore my Chrome defaults and then um, go back and reset up from there, uh, which is what Ted's showing here. So if you go down to the very bottom of that, or if you were to go down to the very bottom of that, I you will see do. What the, I'll do, I'll uh, just yeah. stop sharing a moment. Then I will whiz that page. And grab down. another screenshot of it. Um, well, I can actually share it. It won't matter. I don't think there's anything in there to worry about. No, you can actually share it. So that's fine. I'll it's share that. There we are. <laughs> yes. Right. So yes, yeah, so you can right. see way down at the very bottom. Uh, at the top, you just scroll down until you see. Where are we? Media. Yeah, very, very, very bottom. You were there. Reset browser settings. Move your mouse to the left. There you go. You're right on top Sorry. of it. There it is. <laughs> so I was looking at it and couldn't see it. <laughs> there, that removes all of your extensions and everything else. I had a, I had a little issue too, um, which it was a good thing that I did this. I had one extension that I don't know was really slowing down Chrome, something awful. And by going back to the um, restoring default settings and going and choosing each extension selectively, it mu it must have fixed that. So now my Chrome is running back to normal again. So sometimes it's worth going through and doing that every once in a while. It doesn't affect your book bookmarks or anything that you've saved, but um, it does allow you to uh, get back to the Chrome defaults and check and everything over again. The other problem that I'm not having, that John is having, is that his lower thirds keep disappearing. Um, and the only way he can get them back is by actually popping it out of the hangout and coming back in. But I didn't exactly see when John lost them again. So they might be uh, staying on there for about two minutes, something like that, before they are disappearing. So there's yeah, they're another disappearing. default, uh, or another default. There's a fault on there somewhere. There's another issue. And issue. the funny the funny thing about when Google makes changes to different things, they do it in various parts of the world, so you never quite know whether we've got the same thing. I may see something that Ted doesn't see. Ted may see something that I don't see. Somebody in Australia or New Zealand or whatever may see something completely different than either of us. It's very interesting. <laughs> so uh, I don't know. I, I say we'll just wait it out a couple of days and see if they reappear. But um, I'm just going to check and see if I can do a regular... Um, mm, let me try this a second. I'm going to just try and yeah. see if I can do a, uh, a regular lower third. It didn't pre-populate my lower third for some reason. But it would be good if you're having any of these issues just to make a comment on here so we can see how um, widespread this is or they're just isolated um, problems. Exactly. So my lower third is on, if you believe that, but not showing, as you can plainly see. It ain't there. <laughs> so, and that's just the standard lower third isn't showing at all either. So, interesting. Yeah, I thought I was going crazy for a while because I have a whole setup of different lower thirds. I even have one that kind of screens me out if I'm producing, so that it just shows like the black or the gray of the background. And that wasn't working. I had to appear live in person for something. Go very, very challenging. <laughs> very challenging. So, anyways, if you guys are having any of these challenges, one, we love to hear about it, but two, we hope that some of the suggestions we gave you will at least help you work it out so that you're in a working scenario and you can at least keep moving forward. Like, I don't have my lower thirds, but it doesn't keep me from still doing stuff here, so that's a positive sign. I can still make videos. I can still do a hangout. It's all good, right? And if you've got a partner, you can say, just check the site out on his lower thirds. <laughs> Go figure, right? <laughs> so yeah, so that's 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 at least a positive thing. You know, we have friends that we can test stuff out on in other places. So, hey, all good. Enjoy, and um, like I said, I I'm guessing I'm probably not the only one encountering this. So yeah, we'll wait for the comments to come in, and we'll go from there. There you go. So have fun, everybody. Okay, bye now.